Here he goes hard. As I crossed the door, I entered into the Omega building, the heart of Operation Jericho. It was a cold, dark industrial place with containers and barrels everywhere. On my right, there was the control room where they monitored the outer cameras. And, of course, the asshole that controlled them. The guy I tricked with the pizza, who was coming over to get it. Reality was going to hit him in the face. Give me the fucking pizza and get out. Of course. You are, friend. I'm not your friend, buddy. What the fuck? It doesn't weigh shit. Son of a bitch. You bake these thinner by the hour. <laughs> it's empty. Where the hell is my pizza? Look at what's on the box. What? Where? <laughs> <laughs> I was inside the Omega building. I just had to reach the rooftop and pray that I'd find a helicopter. They put a lot of effort into the security of that compound. The guards weren't the typical ones I've encountered before. They were... <laughs> Scandinavian guards. <laughs> the normal guards. They were light sleepers, too. Kyllä ne saattaa herätä ilmeisesti. Oops, I fell asleep. Hey, escaping prisoner, set down! I fell asleep. Ei kyllä kauan. Oops, I fell asleep. They put a lot of effort in... X Terminator guards. On ehkä typerin mahdollinen kohta tässä näin. Tosi mä voin aika huoletta nyt käyttää noita pottia sitten, niin... Mutta joo, niin kuin äsken, äsken mentiin, niin tuolta yli ja ympäri. Ja sidotaan noin vartijat.
Kengän nauha varasta. Täytyy ihan kyn, kympilä sähälätä ennen kuin mä opin nää pelit. Kaikki on täältä pasifioitu. Paitsi nää kaksi. Eli tämä peli luuppi juurikin, mitä me ollaan harjoiteltu. Ammutaan molemmat. Varmaan, että se ei anna mun aina, ei hyväksy mun näppäin komentoja aina. Oops, I fell asleep. Todella hienoa. Ei yhtään stressaavaa. Ei niinku vähäisemmässäkään määrin. Tää on niinku sataprosenttinen pasifistipeli. patient escaped from a ward. I played along. I'm Fox, son of Zox. I hail you, O Lord of the Labyrinth. What's behind that door? A dark labyrinth filled with deadly traps. Why did they build a maze down here? They didn't. The labyrinth already existed. This building was built over an old prison. Which was built over ancient catacombs. Uh -huh. It is said that the souls of the prisoners still dwell there. Are you trying to scare me with that children's story? It is merely a warning. Such is the esteemed duty of the Lord of the Labyrinth. I was curious about what was inside the Labyrinth, but I had no business in these catacombs. I was focused on my escape, so I didn't think about those ridiculous stories. Although later, I'd be back. Do you wish to enter the labyrinth? No, thank you. Ah. 
Na, to len tu. Freeze! Hands up! What happened with Dr. Hoffman is kind of long to explain. Do you want me to summarize it? <laughs> don't even think about it. Any detail can be crucial, so don't skip anything. Now, I want you to drop that fissile core uranium-235 isotope. <laughs> okay. How in the world do you know that it's a fissile core uranium-235 isotope sample? What else would be in the hands of a scientist <laughs> who's expertise <laughs> in fissile core uranium-235 isotopes? How do you know I'm a scientist whose expertise is in fissile core uranium-235 isotopes? I know everything about Operation Jericho. Now, drop that sample. Do you know what will happen if I drop this and the flask is broken? Of course I know. The radiation will flood the whole room. And that would kill us all. I know. I'm not telling you to literally drop it. I mean, slowly set it on the table. It's okay. Don't get nervous. Now turn around. Slowly. I'm afraid I can't turn around slowly. Because we're working in a 2D environment. <laughs> I can turn in multiple. <laughs> around 90 degrees twice. So you're the brains behind that. You will get away with this, bastard. Operation Jericho will die with you. Everything okay, Dr. Hoffman? Oh, God. He has a weapon. Wait. You said Dr. Hoffman. Is your surname Hoffman? Yes. Fuck. Why? What's up? I had a neighbor called Hoffman. He was tall, <laughs> German, and hairy. He won the lottery, but died of gonorrhea the week after. Poor man. Yes, life can be cruel sometimes. But enough stories. What's the purity of the isotope you're using? 95%. Are you mad? That purity is highly unstable. You need to generate an absolute void field. And contain that isotope in an electromagnetic field. That's what we do. We have containers of 500 megajoules. You're playing God. Rabble like you invented the H bomb. You disgust me. Hold on. Fuck. H as in Hoffman. You invented the H bomb. <laughs> what are you saying? The H comes from hydrogen. <laughs> Hydro what? Don't try to confuse me with your scientific slang. Whether or not you're the mind behind this, you're the accomplice of a nuclear menace. Say goodbye, Dr. Hoffman. Wait. I did it against my will. Right. They have my daughter. If I don't do what they say, they'll kill her. Your daughter? Where are they keeping her? They have her working as a doctor. In the Alpha Building. Ah, the hmm. Alpha Building. The same he's one he's where he's I met the that. doctor. Suddenly, I pieced things together, and everything made sense. There were two doctors in that building. <laughs> Although I never saw this man's daughter. Doctor, how old is she? Uh, somewhere in her 30s. In her 30s? What kind of answer is that? A good father would say she turned 32 last April 31st. April only has 30 days. <laughs> subject. What sort of father are you? It's okay. I confess I've never been a good father since I've spent all my time <laughs> absorbed in science. Not mine. Not mine either. Excuse me one moment. Hello, honey. This is not a good time. It's never a good time for you, Dad. I know, I know. But my current situation is particularly disastrous. Why? Because a man is pointing his gun at me. What? Who is he? I don't know. He doesn't seem like he's from here. I think I know who it is. <laughs> Ask him if his name is Jesse Fox. Hold on. Uh, pardon me. Are you Jesse Fox? Yes. Yes, it's him. 
Damn it all to hell. Do you know him? Honey, are you there? Hello? She hung up. <laughs> Oops. Now it's mine. Jesse Fox here. Over. Can you tell me what the hell you're doing? Doctor, hey, hello. How are you? Not very happy, knowing that you're aiming a gun at my father. What? <laughs> your... your father? Yes. Doctor, this is not your father. What do you mean? Of course he is. That's what they're trying to get us to believe. <laughs> in truth, he's the father of another doctor that works in your building. What? There are no other doctors. <laughs> I'm the only one here. They're trying to make us believe that too. They're manipulating us. <laughs> it's your father, <laughs> by any chance. An expert in <laughs> nuclear chemistry who works in the Omega building? Yes, he is. The evidence finally collapsed in on itself. Besides two doctors, there were two scientists. Who <laughs> <and others. laughs> <laughs> also had a doctor daughter and the doctor's father. Really? Then explain something to me. How is it possible that someone like you, dedicated to looking after others, has a father that is involved in the annihilation of millions of people? What are you saying? My father is a good man. He's a brilliant scientist, not a killer. Well, the man in front of me is working with uranium for nuclear weapons that will be used to annihilate entire cities. What? No, no, this can't be. You see, I told you he wasn't your father. What should I do? Do I kill him? What? No! Tell him that... Uh -huh. Doctor, I can't understand you if you cover your mouth. <laughs> Doctor, she hung up. Why did you tell her? Now my own daughter will hate me. Don't worry, she wasn't your daughter. <laughs> she was the other doctor. What are you talking about? They're the same person. That's what they're trying to make us believe. <laughs> they're toying with you us. Have... Are you really doing this for your daughter? Yes. I want her to be safe. Millions of people can die. I prefer the deaths of millions of people over the death of my precious daughter. Right. You're a monster. It's not called being a monster. It's called being a father. <laughs> if you had a daughter, you would understand, Mr. Fox. Enough. Where is the rooftop? Uh, above? <laughs> Don't be an asshole. I know that. I mean... Do I reach the rooftop? And don't stall me. Understood? Another stupid answer and I shoot. I don't think you'll do it. You don't look like an assassin. Really? <laughs> what have you done? Fuck, it was an accident. <laughs> <sighs> it is but a scratch. Come on, my friend. Stand up. I'm going to repeat the question one last time, and this time I won't miss. Excuse me, you didn't miss. You hit me. That's true. Then this time I won't heal anyone. How do I reach the rooftop? Th there is a lift that reaches the rooftop. You just have to keep going up as much as you can. But you will need a level 4 access card to go out. Well, in that case, give me a level 4 access card. We, we don't have one. We just have level three access cards. I swear. Fuck. I'll have to search for it. Now, continue working as if nothing happened. <laughs> <laughs> you <laughs> to or do something suspicious, you'll kill us. I promise the doctor not to kill anyone. Hoffman's daughter or the other one? The other one. Then you had no intention to shoot me, right? Exactly. You see? I told you that you didn't look like an assassin. I'm glad you're not one of those bastards. You can't imagine how much I hate myself for what they're forcing me to do. In the end, I talked to them about my escape, about Colonel Harris, and the promise I made to him to call the cavalry if I managed to escape. 
That gave Dr. Hoffman and his team some small hope of rescue. He promised to delay the preparation of the uranium that would be used in Operation Jericho for as long as he could. After that, I asked him for some assistance in my escape, but he was terrified of being discovered, which would compromise his daughter's safety. So he decided to stay neutral, but still volunteered some information. Kosto kryydia sen tekemistä hajota veitsä. You're not going inside, are you? I'm just going to have a quick look. <laughs> crazy. Without an anti-rad suit, you will die in just a few minutes. Aha. Uh -huh. Don't shoot in the lab. Most of these devices don't react well to bullets. Be careful in there. There are patrols of mechanical spiders. They can see in every direction. Can they be shut down somehow? Only with an electromagnetic grenade. But it would only last a few seconds. Enough time to let them taste my fists. Thanks for the warning. Please carry on with your genocide work. Mikä arachnofobia? Se meni ihan ok. Kun on Nintendo, Nintendo biisi. Tilanne on kans ihan hyvä. Mr. Fox! Mr. Fox! I'm coming! What's up, Hoffman? My daughter. She is not replying. Isn't she a doctor? She must be operating on someone. Right when you come into my life? <laughs> Too many coincidences. What if they killed her? Why would they do that? If they do, you no longer have a reason to continue your work here. You're right. But... Relax and wait a while. And remember to delay those nuclear warheads as much as you can. God knows what will happen if they get completed.
You're not going inside, are you? I'm just going to have a quick look. Are you crazy? Without an anti-rad suit, you will die in just a few minutes. Radioaktiivinen. Radioaktiivisuuspuku päälle ei. Pystyy heittämään granaatteja. You're not going inside, are you? I'm just going. Teillä on fiksu idea. Joo, että tää on ihan tahallaan tehty tämmönen vanhanaikainen pelimekaniikka. Okay, joo, en, en pysty lyömään. You're not going inside, are you?
sucks. Are you there? Here I am, Robert. Guess where I am. I don't think you're home. The radio signal wouldn't reach. I'm in the Omega building. Fuck, man. Where they're prepping the nukes? You decide to stop them? What a change of heart, man. No, it wasn't intentional. <laughs> the wild <laughs> there. Trying to ride a helicopter out of here. Guess that whole runaway by sea plan didn't work out, eh? Just forget about that. I'll see what I can find out about that building. On, siis näkö, näkee kaikkiin, kaikkiin suuntiin. Okei, ehkä niitä ei tarvinnut räjäyttää sitten kaikkia. Mulla on jatkuvasti näitä, näitä käyttää. Ammu. Noin muut kyllä ampuu näköjään. Hey friend, still there? Still here, Robert. Guess where I am. I don't think you're home. The radio signal wouldn't reach. I'm in the Omega building. Fuck, man. Where they're prepping the nukes? You decide to stop him? What a change of heart, man. No, it wasn't intentional. Then why the hell are you there? Trying to ride a helicopter out of here. Guess that whole runaway by sea plan didn't work out, eh? Just forget about that. I'll see what I can find out about that building. threats or Hey, a coin. 
coin. Hilonen tarvitaan. Tänne pääsee kolmosella. This was the access card I needed to reach the rooftop. Now I just had to check if there were any helicopters up there. Niin, mitä jos siellä ei ole? document was a shopping list. A collection of military vehicles they bought from the Soviet Union when it collapsed. Oh. Trucks, tanks, armored vehicles, helicopters, and nuclear submarines. Kappas. Submarines like the one that attacked me. Now they have one less. Oh. The fourth document was the logbook of a mini rescue submarine. Jo, tämä. It mentioned... Tämä käytiin läpi. Nyt täällä tapahtuu jotain todella typerää todennäköisesti. Hei, a coin! <laughs> Hyvää päivää! some photos on a desk. I had a look at them because, you know, I was born curious. Curious? Don't you mean nosy? There were shots of some guys loading something big onto trucks. Something that looked like concrete blocks. Fuck. These were the photos Robert was taking just before he was captured. Jesse here. Do you copy? I hear you. Guess what I found? The love of your life? <laughs> your photos. Oh, really? They didn't destroy them? No. They must have Diogenes Syndrome. <laughs> <laughs> are you saying my pics are trash? Man, these pictures leave a lot to be desired. Did you take them with one of those disposable cardboard cameras? <laughs> <laughs> You're such an ass. Only the smartest of them. Take them with you, my friend. I hope they help you for something. We'll do. Over and out. Tähän kummaa hyötyä näistäkin voisi olla. 